Hello, this is Kiss Baloo, and welcome to more Let's Play Final Fantasy VI! We're about to go into here, but first, I told you that I would go over all of the rages that I got for Gal. Um, I will tell you right off the bat, my list is a, an abbreviated form of a recommended list that I got from a FAQ on GameFAQs. So I advise you to look over there if you want a more complete list. But, let's see. Monsters I wanted were the jellyfish monster from the trench, which is called an Aspiran. The Chimera, which you already saw. The, the General, which is from the Magitech Research Facility. The, you know, why don't I just... The Magna Rotor, which was from our escape from the facility. The Destroyer, which was the Rhino thing in the Magitech Research Facility. Then the Hill Gigas, which was the giant from Zozo. The Veal Dancer, which was the chick from Zozo. And, of course, the Stray Cat. Now, I want basically all of these because they have a single powerful ability. In many cases, magic. In a few cases, not magic. Um... Magnet Rotor. Ha ha! Now, before we continue, there's one other thing I should go over, and that's, hey, this is my party. This is the one we're going to work with for a bit. I'll miss having an OP Sabin. But, it's time for a change, I think. Um, I have this stuff all set up. You know, I don't think he, he should actually necessarily have to have a Genji Glove, but anyway. And, I did put, yeah I did, okay. And here are our espers. Incidentally, magic plus two. Strength plus one, strength plus two, and HP. Okay, with all of that out of the way, let's get a move on. Imperial Observation Post! Wait, what? Oh, okay. Um, you'll notice. All the guards are gone. We shouldn't stand around. Let's go. Oh, and incidentally, if I'm talking a little less or my voice comes out weird, or or most likely I'd break into a coughing fit, it's because I had a cold last weekend, which I've recovered from, but my throat isn't 100% yet. Needless to say, this is going to be a short recording session. Um, anyway, is there anything down here? Uh, well, there is, but we can't reach it. No, that, that m makes sense. Hmm. But are there any clocks? That's the real question. No, I don't think so. Okay, well, we may as well go in then. Or go around. And go past. And then out, and then in again. Into the sealed cave. This sounds familiar. Very familiar. Okay, so, let's get a move on. Right off the bat, there's a box here! And also, these guys. Let's see... Where is the cat? There it is. Behold the power of Cat Scratch! 800 damage! <laughs> Nearly 900! Also, Fyra! I guess. Really? He didn't have Fyra? An Assassin's Dagger! Okay, so, let's just take a look at that. 
Uh, oh, hey, I could actually replace the Thieves' Dagger with this if I wanted to. However, I'm not... It has higher magic, too. That's actually pretty good. But I'm not going to, and here's why. Well, this place actually is full of undead. So you should not put this on, because you'll regret it. Plus, also, being able to steal is nice, but no, you actually shouldn't do it because of the undead. Oh, and one other thing. I didn't actually show this off yet, but... I have a lot of new magic! And, well, maybe not Terra specifically. She has a little bit of new magic. But Locke has a lot of new magic. And... He but Cien doesn't actually have very much. Basically just cure magic on him. And I think it's similar in Gao. Well, no, Gao has more because... Well, in theory. Gao doesn't have freaking anything. Wow. Okay. Yeah, I actually spent most of my time with uh, Setzer, I want to say. And Locke. Whereas Gao would have been in my party when I was training, but Gao has special requirements because I'm in the Velt. Uh, speaking of actually, I really got to tell you... Where do I want to go? I want to go over here. I really want to got to tell you... The Kazakiri! Uh, wait. Think about what I'm saying, then say it, before I get... Okay. I ha went through hell to get the last two... Rages on Gal. Those last two ones were the Stray Cat, typically, and the Hilgigas. Because the thing is, you can predict to a degree which rages you'll get in the Velt and when, but it's not an exact science, and it's just. I spent a really long time getting those last two. <laughs> Ah, uh, anyway. Anyway, what was I doing? Right! The sword! The Kazakiri! 20 stronger. And it has a special effect, potentially. This, incidentally, is the sword I failed to steal from number 128. Since I was just editing that earlier and realized I forgot to tell you what the sword was! Okay, now... Here's how this goes. Wait, what? Wait, why did I get into battle? I wasn't moving! That's kind of bullshit. Okay, um... I don't remember who's good at fire. So I'll use Cat Scratch. You know, it'll work. It's pretty effective. Or I could just use a phoenix down if things get really dire, I suppose. Ah. Okay, well it is fair to say Cast Scratch does have somewhat variable damage. But it's still really good. There we go. Now it's... changing. Um... There we go. There we go. Box! What the hell is that? Oh, I did it again. Why do I do that every time, man? Just, just move on. Just move on. Where is the jitty? Uh, I thought I saw it. But I'm not seeing it. Oh, it's an accessory. It changes slots to guild toss. That is actually useful at the very end of the game, but not so much right now. Oh. Okay, that was my bad. I probably shouldn't should have moved before I opened my menu. Flip. Oh. Nope, that spot wasn't any good. Okay. Let's try that again. And again, I get into battle when I'm not moving. What the hell? Um... 
I know one of the ones that got on you was for wave clearing. Hmm. I guess that one would work. Oh, right, I'm an idiot. Okay, I just had to consult my notes there. Flip already! Why are you taking so long? You know, I think this area is actually bugged in this version, because it's kind of looking like that. It's certainly a pain in the ass. Flip! Okay, let's try this again. Flip! There we go. Okay, I just got dumped into the lava. Wrong spot, clearly. Okay, made it. It helps if I walk into the thing. Okay. Ha! Ah. That was a pin in the ass! Let's try something different than the Stray Cat. Um... Let's see. Let's try Chimera! Chimera is probably the wrong choice against this guy. To be honest. Chimera is really good for the cloud clear... For the crowd clearing, though. Because of Aqua Breath. Which is really powerful. And hits everyone. Fortunately, also effective against the undead. Speaking of, let's see. Actually, no, someone else should do that. Uh, why does he have so much MP drain? When did that happen? Hmm. Anyway. Anyway. Cure! Ra. Okay, I made it. We're out! Whew. Um, I got that. I'm on here. Okay. Now, I believe uh, more bridges, damn it. It's a high either, which is not actually very useful right now. Well, I guess it technically is. Well, no. Well, uh, I just don't think either are very useful in general, to be honest. It's like, for myself at least, I very rarely use them. And... They just don't do that much. Oh, that reminds me. I need to test something. Haha! -ha! Aka Breath! Less effective when there's more than one of them. Good to know. I need to change around Cien so he only has one weapon because I'm not certain whether or not it is more effective using um, Bushido with one weapon or two. Woo, magic! So, having said that,
Let's do that. Who has the golden terror does? Okay. And then I will know. More zombie dragons. Typical. Tamir worked pretty well, so let's keep it that one up. Maybe I should have gone to Cat Scratch after all. Okay, that is actually dealing more damage, which makes sense if it only uses a si the first weapon. Because the way the Genji Gloves work, or dual wielding in general usually, is it reduces the damage that the one weapon deals by... I'm actually not sure how much. But it reduces your strength, basically. So effectively, if you're only hit with one weapon, you deal less damage than you would if you only had that one weapon. But you deal more damage with two if you hit with both of them. However, since I'm using Bushido, I'm only hitting with one of them, and I don't benefit from dual wielding. Not that, I don't, not that I think I'm losing much damage from it either, but I'm not benefiting from it, so I may as well have a shield and have better defense. Okay then. Um, I want to go this way. That's not moving. Oh, wait, do I want to go this way? Or do I want to go... I think I want to go this way, actually. Okay, yeah. I want to go... Okay, so I might be a little bit lost. Um, My directions are not foolproof, unfortunately. Is there a... No. I want the box, but I'm pretty sure I need a switch to get it. Hey, those guys are new, I think. These guys? Yeah, I'm pretty sure they are. I feel like using... Oh, you know what? I don't know who I should be using. Well, it's too late now, but... I should use the power of... The General? No, not the General. The Templar! That's the one. It is Fire 2. A.K.A. Fire Up. Actually, speaking of Fire Rock, Locke can totally cast that shit. So, I'm not sure why I'm not just doing that. I don't know. Whatever. I mean, I'm almost done now, so... No real point in it, but... I could have definitely opened up the battle. With just a Fire Rock. Oh well. Ha! So many phoenix sounds, so much holy water, so little time. Um, what is... Wait, does anything happen if I pull this? I wonder if this will fix the bridge. Well, that's not quite what I meant. But... Haha, -ha, there's a bridge! Not really quite where I was expecting it, to be honest. Whatever. Just hurt. Yes, Aqua Breath. That'll kill them quickly. Quickly! Quickly! Maybe not. Could be quicker. Like, just, just throwing that out there. Wait, is that one really not dead? That's surprising. Oh, well, there it goes. Hmm. Can it be dead now? Mm, yep, I think. Ha ha! Success!
Finally, it's another Genji Glove! And now, I can just really... Okay, as I was saying, now I just want to quickly hurry over here, because... oh. Pull the switch! Wrong switch. A ninja! Flames... <laughs> flame scroll! Um, I will actually say, this is can be a pretty useful battle, because normally you can't find ninjas until a fair bit later in the game, and they are a pretty useful raid for Gao. Um, not one I'm particularly interested in, but they can be useful. No, And I was just about to claim all the treasure! Okay. Um... No. Okay, now quickly pull the switch. Run inside. Ah. Okay, this is actually getting ridiculous. For the last four minutes, I've been trying to get in here because there's a damn save point. Ah! And also a tent, I think. Yeah, a tent, which I'm gonna use now. And now this episode is way too long. Well, at least on my end. So, bye. <laughs> Sorry. Ah, uh, until next time, this has been, when we complete, I guess, the cave, this has been Let's Play Final Fantasy VI with Chaos Baloo, and have a good day.